going back in. Autumn Sky Chaser 10 total, what's up? Currently making Oreo truffles for New Year's party tonight. Got any fun plans? Those sound good. Good fire rate, good damage, good health, good item. Active item. Wonderful. Uh, yeah. New Year's plan, going to Josh's place. He's got a cyberpunk themed. How the fuck did that hit me? I was way far away from it. Fucking liar. New Year's party, cyberpunk theme. Lots of lasers and neon lights, and I'm gonna wear my light up tie and shit. I bought six bottles of champagne for everyone. Wow, didn't void. Cyberpunk theme, damn, that's killer. Yeah, Josh is super pumped for it. He has some sort of like big group game planned too. Like last year we did this, uh, I don't know what it's called, but I think you can like buy it at a game store. Essentially, there's two different peop there's two different parties of people, right? You split people into two rooms. One person, there's two people total that are secret agents or something like that. There's a red team and a blue team. And then there's like a red double agent and a blue double agent. And like you have to go around asking questions and somehow figure out who are the spies. Without like, like you can show people that like what your card is, but you can also choose not to show them and code names. I don't remember what it, what it's called. I'm no fucking clue, but we got everybody at the party involved. So Josh is super into like big group games. It's always awkward though, because there's like a good 30% of the people that just really don't give a shit. Cooler version of Mafia. Social engineering games are great. What about Four Souls? Four Souls is not good for... It, it, Four Souls is like literally made for you and that one other friend that's super geek out about Isaac. Everyone else is like, fuck, I hate that game. Because you get the, the gist of it and then you slaughter your friends and then they all hate you and then... They never want to play again. That's exactly what happened with every single person that I played Four Souls with. It just absolutely creamed them and they're like, fuck this game. I hate it. Because I don't even get the references, so there's not even, like, nostalgia. And it's like, well, fuck, like, I don't have anybody to play with then. Slash, you can't play with more than four people. So a party of 30 people... ...bring four souls out. You, you explain to me how that works. Code names! Code names is not good for 30 people. 30 people, you guys! You read my penny question, or am I being stupid? When did you send it? Ever think about doing any games like Rainbow Six Siege or multiplayer in general? Um, yes, I have thought about doing them, and it was a resounding absolutely not. That is not my shit. Um, you know, I, I did try Apex Legends there for a while, but competitive... Multiplayer games literally make my head fucking pop out off of my like my body my my head detaches and blood squirts everywhere So I don't play multiplayer Competitive games Can't handle it You've seen salts, but not like this That sounds messy. Yeah, a little bit. Mildly. Werewolf? Yeah, that's the same thing as Salem. Salem, Werewolf, Mafia, whatever name you want to give it. But still, still not good for 30 people. Mafia would be good for a group of 10, I would say, tops. Otherwise, it gets too messy. I'm Bruno, or the, the the three people that don't give a shit, just, just ruin it, you know what I mean? Welcome, Bruno. Should use my active item more, probably. Whoa! Woo! Wowzers. Um, worth of the one bomb? Probably. Play hide and seek. What about sardines? Classic. What a classic. 
I missed him. And one job. Musical chairs. You know what's good for 30 people? You get that big parachute game. Remember when we were like five years old? And everyone like sit there and ru rustle the thing and then you have the sharks underneath and then they grab people and grab- That's good, that- you can do 30 people for that. What's your reaction to YouTube Rewind 2019? What's that? I've never heard of it. Um, I'm fine with actually not doing any of these. Angel, maybe. I love the big parachute game. Remember that from elementary school, and I also remember those little, uh, those little, they call them scooters, right? But it was just like a piece of plastic with those wheels, and then you'd like grab onto the sides and like run over your fucking fingers every goddamn time. Like every time. Oh, was that a double key room up here, or was that a single? Because if it's a library, I wanna, I wanna go in. I think the library's down this way. Because I think the start room was... Zzz, 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 zzz. Next one down. No. Start room is here. Balls. Just awful. Black runet? Shit, fine. Yes! Max fire rate. Master plumber, tier one. Welcome, friendo. My ankles are non-existent. The pain shivers. Any of you guys ever do that thing where like, uh... You had the, the bean bags, and you had to like, it was like dodgeball, but you had to slide bean bags and try to hit the other kid's feet. And you were supposed to be like... Friendly for kids. Because you don't huck them at their face. Or there was the one where, um, we had... I don't remember like, what we were throwing, if they were like... We had the soft little dodgeballs, right? And everybody had a, a pin. And you had to like try to throw the dodgeball and knock over the bowling pin. Uh, no one knew to, knew about beanbag toss. Yeah. That was probably like the highlight. Like that was a lot of fun, beanbag toss. There was always that kid that ended up chucking the, the beanbag anyways. In the back of the head of someone on his own team. Fucking Cory. It was always a Cory. God damn it, Cory. Um, ew, I'm not really psyched about either one of those. $2, too legit to quit. When is the last time you broke the game? Steam sale, shop refresh. I feel like I hardly see this anymore in my playthroughs. Uh, we don't necessarily do that a whole lot with Eden. If we had Isaac, it would probably be like every other game. Eucharist is 100% Angel Room all the time, right? So that's good. Because I'm thinking of uh, duality. Eucharist is, is better. Yeah, no, okay, I'm fine with that then. And I don't need to bomb the statue to get the thing anymore because we have 100% chance guaranteed. Okay, no, I'm, I'm on board. You're right. This is Zodiac, I think. Randomly gives you a Zodiac sign per floor. This one being... What's the name of it? What's the one that gives you piercing? Is it Sagittarius? Sagittarius? What's the name of the one that gives you uh, a goat face? Capricorn. I don't know my zodiac symbols. I just, I'm gonna go out there and say it. I personally do not believe in, um, what's it called? Astrology, horoscopes. I think that if life was that magical that we could predict that many things out of the stars, the fucking US government, we'd be like, do we invade Iraq? Stars! Like, you know what I mean? We would use that shit more if, if it worked. I don't know, that's my opinion. You can believe in it though, I don't care. I, I think, uh, I feel the same way about um, just all religions in general. 
uh, the, the second that it starts causing you to hate other people or judge people or harm other people or harm yourself, no, we're, we're bad. Uh, that's, nope, bad, I hate it. But if you go and use it as a way to build yourself up, feel good about something or believe in something and it just gives your life meaning and purpose, wonderful. We all need something, right? And you saying that uh, I really get a lot out of horoscopes is not really different than me being like, you know, I really enjoy, I don't know, playing video games. Do what makes you happy. Great perspective. Did I say too legit? I did read that one. Okay, I thought I heard a notification. I was wrong. So what, giving, your, giving you a massive ego? I, I definitely think that uh, people can take anything at all and make it negative. So of course, of course religion is not any different than that because we're humans. Some people will corrupt it, some people will take advantage of it. But like I said, that goes for literally everything that humans have ever done. I don't have a bomb. How do we always get so political? This isn't political though. This is uh, acceptance. Is there a, is there a, 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 a political group that's just about not believing in anything? and just accepting everybody else's stuff and being like, fuck it. Don't hurt people. Not really. That's one thing that I don't like about politics is there's always like, wait, you wanna be, uh, you know, you wanna be conservative? Well, then you gotta hate on these people with us. You wanna be liberal? Well, then fuck these guys. And I'm like, I just like, well, ah. I kinda wanna just exist. Can we just, can I just be here? So I'm trying to take that and go like, <laughs> go away. Politics, poopatics. $2, well I mean, uh, if you're gonna say my name again, I guess I gotta give more, lol, give me another YouTube video of you breaking the game for funsies. Breaking the game for funsies. I'm not like done with breaking the game. Oh, uh, we really wanted to get a bomb for the thing. Is this bomb unreachable? It must be. <laughs> but I just gotta know Is there a bomb? Gotta know one thing. What is it? Are you ready? No, I said no bomb. Bomb to get a bomb, stonks. What's the streak at? I don't remember. Hots for president. Hots 2020. I just kinda wanna be here. <laughs> this is the tagline. If I came out and actually like try to run like legitimately, let's say that I just randomly popped out like a like a three billion billionaires that's decided to support me so that I could actually get traction because that's what matters in life is money. Um, then and then I was out there and I was like, let's love on everyone and let's be friends. Just everyone would just be like, fuck you, kill this guy. People would be so fucking mad. People would be raging, and it makes no sense, but to people would. People would be so fucking pissed off that I tried to split the difference in the middle. They'd be like, fuck that. These people have to die, so you said that they're fine, though then you need to die. So you want me to be assassinated, is that it? <laughs> For a great way, great way to win an argument is to misrepresent the other party and tell them what they believe and then tell them how what you made up that they believe is wrong. If you guys, we want to win any argument ever, it's guaranteed. It's guaranteed. Because now you're like, I want Hutz for president. I'm like, you want me to be assassinated? Clearly, you're wrong. In this totally made up scenario that I concocted. 
And welcome to politics! Fuck it. We're now we're there. We're there. Let's stop. Let's be done. Let's talk about puppies. You notice how some dogs are like super cute as puppies and then they're like God's mistake as a full animal? Not pointing any fingers, St. Bernard, but... Full animal. I'm a cat person. Uh, we have Stompy for this floor, so... Let's try not to hit the, the mushrooms. Never huts. Kitties are cuter. Cats are evil. I'm taking a lot of damage because I'm just kind of floundering about, not optimizing my flame. <sighs> I should probably try to be more responsible. And then I walk over a fucking mushroom. I had to there. These angel rooms are supposed to be saving me. Free floating poison clouds to deal with in repentance. Double key door to add. It's a pretty nice top secret room. Could there still be an I am Aram on this floor if this exists? Crowheart, very interesting item. And you know what? In fact, I think it actually, this makes a lot of sense for us to take Crowheart here. Um, it'll dive into our red health before it takes our soul hearts. And since we have Eucharist, Eucharist or Goathead would nullify the not earning a, a room at the end of the boss battle. So perfect, because we can always replace our red hearts. I... I kind of feel like no here. Eucharist could really give us something good. There's two double key rooms, is there? We're one unicorn stomp away from winning. Eucharist can also give you Garbo. There's a lot of garbage in Angel Rooms. I really wish the Angel Rooms were better. Triple shot. It's really not my favorite. I feel like the tears down that it gives you is not worth the triple shot, but here we are. I, I have a really hard time saying no to it, obviously. Because it like seems like it's a special item, right? What's the name given to the special items? Like there's a, sp I think it might be special item. There's like a special item counter in the game. One of the hidden stats. Triple shot versus triple shot. Quad shot I think is worth it. Got my keys back. Isaac is one big gamble. Anybody know about the special key stat or special item stat, I mean? No, just me. I'll come back at the uh, eternal heart. Okay, that was a fair start. Really nice fair start there. Well balanced. Fire rate is delicious here. Got that angel room now. I'm gonna take soul, I think is better for me. Ralnor, what's up? 21, happy new year's huts. 
Happy New Year's Eve. Uh, let's hope you're feeling well. Still a silent K in Railner if you want to use the Knurr. You're right, Relkner. I, I forgot. Loud, a loud K. There's a D on the end of it. Panned? All right. Soul is GG. I think on the right is a little like prism that floats around you, and if you shoot through it, it multiplies your tears, which actually could have been pretty okay for triple shot, but the soul will deflect bullets. Undefined. Um, is Undefined the one? It's, it's not as good as Teleport 2.0, right? Undefined can take me to the top secret realm, or possibly I am error. Am I right about that? I don't remember what it does. I think it maybe it's just the secret rooms. But does it take me to the angel or devil room ever? I don't really care. I don't, I don't want it. Undefined teleports you anywhere, right? No, I think it's, it's like a, it's either the secret room, top secret room, or I am error, like, one of those, maybe. Hate it. Bouncies. Okay. If I must. At 13, it really doesn't give us that big of a benefit, but anything that ups our fire rate with triple shot is gonna be good. Crow Heart does make a lot of sense for our longevity, and I've never actually had the ability to take Crow Heart with comfort and ease. So it's kind of a shame that we're passing up this opportunity, but. Undefined is item room, normal secret room, top secret room, or I am error. So it's, it's a risky thing. I like the way that the triangles bounce. Like the path they take. Satisfying. What is Crow Heart? It causes your damage to happen to your red hearts before your soul hearts. Always. Historically bad because you will lose your chance for a devil room on any hit. Assuming you have red health to spare. But with Eucharist or Goathead, that doesn't matter. for Schmelter. We could probably get better things than Schmelter, honestly. Those quick little bastards. Jinxed it. Jinxed it. Need duality so you get both rooms. I'm fine with just angel rooms. <sighs> Giving me the option makes me feel salty because it makes me feel like I chose the wrong one. Hundred bits from Voldo. Is that like budget Voldemort? Uh, we couldn't get you Voldemort, but we did get his cousin Voldo. He's just as pasty, but he's got a nose. It's not really similar. Where's Voldo? Uh, it kind of sounds like the Waluigi version of, uh, or Wario version of Mario. Of, of uh, Waldo, I mean. You know what I'm trying to say. Voldo! Arr. 
He's just everywhere. It's hard not to find him. He's got a bright pink cap on. You lose if you if you spot Voldo before Waldo. Growth hormones. That's the active version of Delirium, right? Or is that the passive? I think that's the active one. That's the active, yeah, so I'll take the miter. Why there's two that look the exact same, that are the exact same? There's little hush, or there's little delirium, and then there's delirious, or something like that? I don't know, poor form. Poor form. Give it a different sprite. Take it, come on, Dad! Dude, the candle is way better. Way better. Yeezy, 100 bits. Is Daddy Hots excited for the Sinvicta Isaac tournament? Yeah, I haven't heard, uh, haven't heard too much about it. So I last talked to him about it. Know any information about how that's progressing? Thanks for the bits, by the way. The bracket was selected, right? How does the Isaac tournament work? Tournament? Tournament, tourney. Combining the two does not make sense. Um, he asked people, and I retweeted this on Twitter, he asked people to submit their favorite Isaac two item combos. And then uh, he's gonna have guests on, I am one of them. And it's just gonna basically be a debate about which item we think is the best between the two. Then he's gonna pit two of them against each other. Two combinations of two. And move up until uh, he finds the the best. Oh, barely didn't get this. Barely. Damn. Could fight the guy, but I just... Uh, I had one key. I mean, we could come back to it later, right? Not really. Steps two. But we could have made sure we, have a, we had a key, but... Probably wouldn't have known I needed a key. I don't know why the, the spike blocks just fucking cheat sometimes. It's actually really annoying. This is kind of weird with bouncy, like it kind of makes it not bounce anymore. Okay, yep. Sacred Heart is the best item. But bouncy bananas. They're gonna be so bruised. I hate banana bruises. It's all mushy. Worst part about fruit. Texture sometimes. I suppose we could hit up the shop with 85 cents. Voldo is a character from a game called Soul Calibur, but you were the first to take it as Voldemort reference, and I laughed so hard at that. I mean, I, I didn't actually think that you believed it was a Voldemort reference. That's just how my brain, that's where it went first. Tournament should be the story challenge. I bet you hate bruises down there. I don't feel like chaos is a good thing to use with a uh, guaranteed angel. There's not even an, an item room left. Or a shop. Chaos is really just meant for shops with reroll machines. That's literally the only place it shines. And on the chest, I guess. 
But if you've already made it to the chest. Whoa. Already in here. Devil items in Angel. No. It could happen, but no. It wouldn't. We'd get nothing but Abel. Bob's brain, Abel. All the garbage. How's your day going? Oh, it's going. Pretty slow day. I sat down to record something and I just, I couldn't pick exactly what I wanted to record. So I was like, we should stream. Now's the time. Bomb upgrades, dude, chaos and bomb upgrades. Hand in hand. I guess we could get a soul heart if I bombed those machines. Or maybe I could just not, maybe we could just not worry about it. Got exactly one soul heart. Have you played Undermined? Undermine, I mean. Um, yeah. Before anybody says, hey, have you played this game or this mod? It would literally take you five seconds to type it into Google search, Huts Undermine, and see a playlist of like 20 plus videos. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm saying good. Like, go watch those. It's good for you. Got you covered for the next 30 hours. Cloud Gaming says, do you have any plans for 2020 for your YouTube channel or Twitch life? Yeah, uh, swapping over and, and doing a more, probably a general gaming approach. Probably another highly edited series. I'm thinking of worst Steam games. Kind of taking the same energy from Worst Mods and applying it to a greater scope that could reach a greater audience. I'm gonna transition um, away from Isaac since Repentance, as far as we know, will be the last one. We've said that, I don't know, 20 times already, but as far as we know, there won't be any more content for Isaac after this last update. I'm mad. People are dumb. What happened? Every update's the last one. I mean, it's, we've, we've actually heard it like at least four times. Same thing with like Gungeon. No more, no more after this. This is the last one. Always another one. Um, yeah. Yeah, we'll go. Double damage here. Look at that. That is, that's cool. Big fan. All right. I feel spicy enough to handle this guy. Test it out. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty nice, though. Dude spanking dudes, 100 bits. Oh, I didn't read the nerd uh, with the 100 bits. Invicta posted brackets to YouTube with the pairs and initial matchups already. He hopes to have it down by the end of January. He has three guest judges ready, including you and a couple more. He hopes to include. I tweet the bracket bid to Huts, and so has Invicta. Awesome. Hunter Bets Dude Spanking Dude says, in the, it's the end of the decade I have been watching for maybe a half a decade since I was in my teens and now I'm 22. I remember watching you on my Wii U great times. Vunderbars. Did Sinvicta like pop into the chat and I missed him? If that happened, I, I would apologize. Is this Twitch code just Sinvicta? Or is there like a number or something on the end of it? Guess I should add him to my highlight list. I didn't see him. Okay, cool. Yeah, if you guys do see him, mods, or you see like Cobalt or like, I don't know, somebody that I should be paying attention to, then like shout at me. Always. It's just Sinvicta. Maybe I should just do that now while it's fresh on my mind because there's no way I'm going to remember in like two hours. Um, what is it called? Address book. Address book. Invicta categories. 
streamer done added cool now it'll like make his chat like a different color chatty's just game changer okay uh this has got to be pisces right that made our tears like super extra large Hello, Huts. Ah, I walked into a fucking red poop when I was reading chat. How's the mood? I'm feeling like pretty chill right now. Not too up, not too down. I'm reserving my energy for later, maybe. So there was a. Uh, there was this this the night that I went out to go watch the new Star Wars movie was meeting up with some friends, and like, not some friends that I see a whole lot, so I feel like it's important for me to be social and like, you know, especially I want to be further friends with them. But I was so fried after the stream that I just kind of sat there and like, didn't say anything like the entire time. And I kind of feel bad about it, but at the same time... You know, they, they didn't understand why I was quiet either, so it's whatever. Whatever, oh well. I don't want that to be tonight. Because there's gonna be, like I said, like 30 people there. I don't want to just sit in the corner and not talk to anybody. So I'm, you know, reserving my energy, like I said. Um, I can get Eden's, uh, Eden's blessing, but I can't use it now. <laughs> I don't think we need the fire anymore. Full mapping is nice, but it's no game changer. Eden soul, not blessing, of course. I think our damage is higher than anything our candle can put out. So, makes sense to do that, and then leave. Pop this in the chest. Go back for a battery! Oh, I could have done both, you're saying. Right, because the room stays open because of Eucharist. It, whatever. I'm not really sweating it, you guys. Like I said, I'm not even using the candle anymore anyways, so... Didn't lose much. I shouldn't be using the candle. Fishy fish, five months, what's up? Hello, Mr. Butts, just wanted to let those who didn't know that Gungeon is free on Twitch Prime. Until February 1st. Free Gungeon, you guys. Now it's your time to try it. So that should be pretty fun. I bought Josh two uh, beam lights for for Christmas. Two beam lights, and then Ryan has a smoke machine. And he's gonna be blasting that shit. I wanna see if I've got a video of the beam lights. I do have a video. I'm gonna show you guys. Let's see here. If I just pop to this, maybe. Here it goes. Like, you kinda. That was like a three second video, but you kinda got to see, like, what they can do. And they just automatically move with the music. Spooky lights. Spooky. It's gonna be, uh, quite the party. Full health. I got the finished gun. I still have yet to get that. Don't have enough keys for that. What is up with that room? It's literally trying to drain all of your keys before you hit the chest. Yeah, right. In your dreams. New Star Wars film? Yeah, the new one. It's the last one, right? Last one. No, that's like saying it's the last Isaac DLC. Last one with Skywalkers.
Last one for this storyline. Right. There's no way they're just gonna, like, bury it and leave it. This'll be fun. Does that multiply every bounce? I think it might. Oh, yeah. Every bounce. Bounce, baby. Bounce, baby. Bounce, 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 bounce. Is that bad form to sing an R. Kelly song? Probably. Raikou, Prime Sub, what's up? My eyes. Isn't it glorious? Try not to blink, challenge. That is extremely bright. Just like me, super genius. It's not the music's fault R. Kelly was a piece of shit. Was, or...? Look at that, look at them just melt to this damage. Something's wrong? No, something's right. Ooh. Even better. This actually is incredibly bright. Like, my eyes are having kind of a hard time looking at this. So many Curse of the Losts. Right? That doesn't really stop me, though. We're fine. Watch me do. Wow, just amazing. Mega Santa, I, I do feel comfortable enough to do that. Need rubber cement and parasite. I can try to do some more rooms. Lard is a big no for me. Kind of looks like fireworks. I feel like that's Cricket's body in general. Very nice. New Year's Eve Isaac run. That's correct, Jimbo Joe. Last one of the year! Last stream of the year. Fireworks for New Year's. Unless you're in Australia. Then no fireworks for you. Last stream of the decade! Stepping it up, dance. I just gotta one up me, don't you? Fill the room with golden bomb. Then use the boom active. You know, that does sound like fun. If I had fast bombs, that would be easier, but you know, we could do it. Funny thing is, I'm Australian. So you were the one that caused the wildfires then. Got it. Another confession. We're getting all the criminals out today. We're celebrating that with you, not one-upping you. That sounds like something that a one-upper would say. It wasn't my fault that you took it that way. <laughs> this is gonna take a while. Fill the entire screen, you say? Pooping out bombs on him. Do 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 do. Like his shots are usually so slow. A lot of them, not those ones, but the other ones, that uh, if I just stand still, I don't even get touched by him. I still think there should be some sort of like laser deflection item, you know? 
There's all these damage negating items. Nothing for lasers. Wouldn't that be cool? Guys, I'm getting tired of this. Can I just pop it? Time to go out with a bang. Yeah. Big bang for New Year's. Get back in there, bombs. Ow. He's still alive. Now I lost my double damage. No, I'm gonna starve. Didn't even go to the next phase. Bomb damage is pretty weak. If I had sad bombs. Bomber boy. Even, uh, what was it, Mega Bombs? Just dodge the lasers. Mr. Mega. Mr. Mega? I was gonna say Mr. Boom, and I was like, that's not right. Frickin' Mr. Boom. Alright, done.